Hey, um, this is Tony Sakalas from Bama Insider. Uh, I, I just want to know how, how difficult are these Ole Miss uh, running backs to stop and, and kind of corral both in the passing game and, 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 and in the running game? Just, and, and how do you guys plan on, on kind of maintaining that? I mean, they definitely do a great job. Their whole entire offense do a great job. Um, fast tempo offense, move the ball quick, try to, you know, get you out of place. Um, so they definitely do a great job of that. Um, so, you know, preparation is key this week. Michael? Yeah, how, how would you say it's gone so far for you, first four games at Alabama? How would you assess your play? I mean, you know, definitely there's a lot of room to improve. Um, that's kind of something that I, you know, pride myself on is um, – I always try to find something I can work on, um, but it's been a good time. You know, been a great time. Um, but I feel like you know there's a lot of room to improve as a team too. So, Nick Kelly. Hey Henry, uh, just curious as as the guy who kind of organized the defense, uh, what what is it like when you're facing an up tempo offense like this one? Uh, definitely trying to get the call in fast, um, see the signal as fast as I can, um, and just try to relay the message. You know, echo the call. Um, as much time as I can before the ball snaps, but um, you know, you know, as fast as we get the call, the faster we can line up and play ball. Mike Rodak. Yeah, Henry, just just kind of going off that same question. How do you get ready for that in practice in terms of the speed of, of how Ole Miss runs their offense? Definitely preparation. You know, practice every single day, um, like it's the game. Um, you got to be able to, you know, get the call, get ready. Um, put your feet in the ground and get ready to play. So, you know, practice this week is huge. David? Henry, you've already faced Emory Jones, who's really good at, at getting out in the open when a play seems to break down. Matt Corral can do the same type of thing. Are there similarities in the way they attack when, when a play kind of seems to break down? Do you, or are there more differences? What do you see in those two? Um, definitely, you know, two great quarterbacks, two really good quarterbacks that we faced, uh, that we're, we're about to face, Matt Corral. Um, but, you know, they definitely can extend plays. Um, so when a quarterback can extend plays, you know, you definitely got to be able to um, have disciplined eyes, um, be ready to break on the ball, um, break if he breaks the pocket. Um, so it's a, it's a big challenge for us, and, you know, we're looking forward to it. Jeff. Henry, you guys got to play a, a lot of players uh, in that win over Southern Miss. Uh, how important do you think depth is going to be Saturday playing an offense that, you know, kind of keeps you on the move and keeps you? Um, you know, it's huge, you know, being able to have guys ready, being able to have guys, you know, know how it feels to be in a game, um, the tempo of a game. Um, so, you know, having the more players ready for a game is huge for us, uh, especially this week. John. Yeah, Henry, have, how much have you heard in the off season this week from, from other guys on defense who were there last year when, you know, they gave up? 48 points and all that. Has that, has that been a hot topic? Do you see teammates kind of fired up about that? Yeah, I mean, you know, definitely they harp on it. It wasn't the game that they wanted. It wasn't the kind of performance on defense that they wanted. Um, you know, so this week has been a huge harp on um, executing what we have to do. You know, Ole Miss is a great team. They do great things on offense. Um, and it's a huge challenge for us. And, um, you know, we're looking forward to that challenge. And, and, you know, it's on to us, you know, just be able to execute throughout this week. Edwin. Hey, Henry, uh, you played Tennessee last year under a similar type defense. Do you think that kind of gave you an advantage coming to Alabama with uh, having played for Jeremy Pruitt? Definitely. You know, Coach, I, Coach Pruitt taught me a lot of the, you know, Coach Pruitt ran a similar scheme, similar defense. Um, so it was kind of huge for me coming here um, just to be able to pick up where I left off at Tennessee. Michael? Yeah, I think that they were talking about it on the broadcast of the night um, uh, that – that Pete Golding was saying that maybe you're doing too much communication before the snap. You need to simplify things and, and just get the, the play ready to, ready to go, ready to call. Uh, what's that conversation like with him, and, and how can that improve? Definitely. Um, you know, just sitting down with Pete and, you know, just trying to figure out how I can better my game. You know, the more, the faster I can get the call in, um, get everybody ready, um, the faster that I can be able to, you know, be more productive on the field. So, um, you know, those conversations are huge. Jeff. Henry, you're kind of late to this party, but, uh, but but you know what a winning tradition and what a track record this program has, you know, accumulated. Um, the Florida game, you know, some people were talking about, well, you know, maybe Alabama is a little vulnerable. And this is kind of one of those crossroads games, you know, is, uh, is Ole Miss going to be the team that 
you know, cracks the code and, and kind of, you know, makes a statement in this game. How badly does a team kind of want to protect this rep and protect the brand and, and keep on this on this winning record right here? I mean, you know, it's a culture that's built here. You know, we don't really focus on the wins. Um, we just focus on what we can do every single day to get better. Um, so we've just been, you know, executing on what we have to do, um, focusing on the fundamentals, um, the hard work, and, you know, the culture that is built here. Um, so really, not really focus on the wins, um, focus on how we can get better as a team.